Well, hello, champions, and welcome to LEGO Worlds. Finally, LEGO has done the game that they always should have done. Since LEGO is all about exploration, imagination, building, they've finally done a Minecraft-like game. And once you get to do exactly those things, you get to build, craft, create. This is LEGO Worlds. I'm totally pumped, very excited. Uh, I've seen about 10 minutes of this game so far. Ooh, the music is epic. Hear that music. So good. <laughs> Unfortunately though, it's gotta come off. So I've seen about 10 minutes of the game. I played for about that. Uh, really have no idea what I'm doing at this point. I made a world that was like a mountain in the middle. You actually get to see when you change the numbers what the world is going to look like before you enter into it. It's procedurally generated just like Minecraft. Uh, in fact, I think it's it's going to be very similar to Minecraft, only instead it's Lego, which is awesome. So awesome. <laughs> so you started off with two characters, and for some reason I now have four, um, which is cool. And I noticed in the 10 minutes you actually like unlock things, but we'll get into that once we get into the world. Uh, so this was my first world. And I only explored for, you know, a little bit. And then I decided, well, I'm going to try again because I didn't really know what was going on. And I put in 13, 13, 13, 13, 13, 6, 6, 6 to make the most unlucky evil world. <laughs> and it's pretty fitting. So, let's let's hop into it. <laughs> let's get this game going. Ah, uh, I'm excited. So I have seen what this place looks like. Uh, is terrifying. Is absolutely terrifying. So I should point out in my first world, with the mountains, uh, there wasn't much going on there. It was just some mountains and some trees. Uh, there was no things, no people, no animals and then immediately oh, okay well when I was here before there was uh, something really scary over here which is not there anymore so and there was a person walking past here anyway so I'm gonna show you um, kind of a little bit how this works you get your tools and you can add terrain I haven't really like experimented with this much There you go. I guess you can change the color too, right? Cool. So you can just add blocks. I wonder, can you scale the blocks? Uh, oh. So yeah, I don't know how any of this works yet. You can make spheres, you can make cubes. Ooh, what happened to me? <laughs> you can smooth out. We'll play with all this stuff a little bit later. Uh, you can do your cust character customization, which is really kind of cool. And from what I've seen so far is you unlock stuff. So I didn't have these pants before. I unlocked a new character at one point. I just ran into someone and it unlocked all these cool things. So we'll try to do more of that. Uh, you get blocks that you can build, so just like in real Lego, I believe. Uh, oh, yeah. So you would pick a block, you could pick a color. And then you can... Oh, that's cool. So I haven't done this yet, so this is very cool. So just like Lego, you can build. And I mean, that's kind of what any Lego oh. fan wants to be able to do in a Lego game. I mean, really. <laughs> There's a dude. Why is that dude coming over here? Should we go talk to him? Hi. Hello. He's an evil wizard. <laughs> Hello, evil dragon wizard. Uh. <laughs> oh. Epic music. Uh. 
I killed the evil dragon wizard. <gasps> and it had unlocked a character. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, it's amazing. <laughs> oh, wow, dude. That is so cool. I am now an evil dragon wizard. <gasps> so I just unlocked that piece, so I'll show you how that works as well. So that's a prop, and it's going to cost me 250 uh, somethings gold. But I think I have 2,000 platinum. So, 250 gold, not a big problem. And now we can place it. Alright. And then, you can destroy them. And you get gold for destroying them. Did I just do fire? <gasps> I think I just did a fireball. <gasps> I don't know how I'm doing that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it does fire. Ah, uh, this is amazing. I am an evil wizard who can shoot fire. And I just started the game a few minutes ago. <laughs> Whoa. This is so cool. Okay, so this is the extent of what I know how to do in this game. <laughs> However, there were some other things. Um, there's already built... You can see there's like vehicles, and there's like creatures, and items, which we have none of. But you can also... What is this? Brick builds. You can also... There's stuff that's already built that you can just place down. Uh, so, on the evil world, oh my goodness, it's huge. We need a gingerbread house. <laughs> uh, I think this is my new favorite game. This is amazing. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. <laughs> oh, I love it. And we have a gingerbread house. Oh. oh! Oh yeah, that's one thing that you guys haven't seen yet, is when you start a new world, you actually skydive in. It's pretty cool. Uh, we will check that out in a bit. Because from what I've noticed, every world that you create, uh, your character transfers over. So you get all the same stuff. Anything you've unlocked, your character uh, goes with you. So you can make as many worlds as you want, maybe. I imagine. What is this? Oh my... <laughs> I needed a window. <laughs> oh, I'm... Oh, I'm very happy right now. Evil wizard. <laughs> oh, let's explore a little bit, shall we? Let's go kill more wizards. Hey! <laughs> Uh, oh, I haven't been in water. Whoop. Okay, so you can jump out of it. Can you go underwater? Whoop. Maybe. So what happens if we attack? Okay, so I'm trying to attack, I'm trying to go under. Well, that seems to be working. Oh. You can kind of cheat, though, <laughs> and see what's under the ground. Okay. Oh. There are lots of wizards. But the, the scary thing I saw, uh, I'm not seeing right now. And I kind of wanted that to be a surprise. Cool. You can, like, parkour. Ooh, we unlocked something. What did we unlock? Was it this? Uh, let's go check it out. Probably 
crops. So it doesn't exactly tell me what it is. Which is okay. I believe it was like... Oh, 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 oh. Um, yeah. 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 This, this is the scary thing. So, being, being foolish, <laughs> I unlocked something. We'll check that out in a minute. <laughs> We're gonna kill the dragon. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe not. I don't, don't know if I'm hitting it. I'm hitting bricks. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I don't know what's happening. What is happening? I'm being chased by it. Uh, he. Oh, I thought he killed me. But apparently, he didn't. Maybe he did, and I just spawned. Is that what? Yeah. Oh, okay. So he's killing me, but I'm just respawning. Um. I don't know if he flew away or if we killed it. Whoop. I don't know. That was terrifying. There. So let's not mess with him. We can't beat it. What is this thing? It's like a lava pool? Interesting. Yeah, so, uh... Uh... Uh, don't jump in lava. Or a mummy. It's a, or a skeleton. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Success. Uh, we unlocked the skeleton? Is that a carrot? I believe it is. So, we can pay this? Oh, we can't. It's too expensive. It's like two billion coins or something. It's a uh, blue coin. Too expensive. Oh, well, that's interesting. So, you do have to destroy stuff. You gotta find gold. Then you can unlock new things. I like that. That's cool. So, nothing seems to be overly dangerous. Like, yeah, we got killed by the dragon, but he's not terrifyingly dangerous. Cool. I really don't know what to do, though, at this point, other than run around. Um, maybe we should dig? Because maybe that's a thing? I don't know. I'm lost. Uh, lower terrain. Okay. Best mining tool ever. Okay, let's go down there. This is kind of fun. It's <laughs> satisfying. Alright. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, it doesn't dig very fast. Though. I mean, kind of did. A little, maybe? Well, can I Can I just destroy it, though, by attacking it? Let's try that. Real quick. Uh, I don't know how to get out of this. Okay. 
So I can. I can. <laughs> There's the parkour. On there. It's really cool because you can like climb trees, you can climb buildings, you can climb everything. It's really neat. Uh, I love that. And just sort of does it automatically. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh my goodness! Mining has never been easier. As a crazy wizard. <laughs> this is this is cool. It doesn't seem like we're unlocking or finding anything. So try this for a bit more. Find a cave? No. All right. So this is early access. So I'm not sure how complete it is yet. Like I said, it doesn't seem to be like dangerous, so there's no like survival element to it yet. So it's more exploration and building and unlocking new things, maybe. Currently. Which is okay. I'm alright with that. But, I don't know. I don't seem to be fine. <laughs> <sighs> and so sometimes he throws fire and sometimes he punches. It seems to depend. Oh, it's distance. Aha. So depending on your distance is going to be whether you throw punches or you throw fireballs. So if we keep a distance, we can just keep mining and keep going down. I, I kind of love the characters. They're really cool. Uh, I think they're doing a good job of this game. Seems good so far. Seems very, very good. Which shouldn't be surprising, though, because LEGO seems to make really good LEGO games. But it's about time they came out with a crafting Lego game. Well, I'm about. I'm, I'm kind of. I'm done with this <laughs> part. So. I think what we'll do is we're going to go to. I wonder if there's a way to explore. Go back and explore our other world. So we need to figure out more of this game, right? Um, oh, the sets. Okay, I didn't. I didn't show this. The sets is actually how I unlocked the character. So. When I put it down, it put like an actual house and like some other things, and then I ran up to this girl, um, and it unlocked her. So maybe we can do that, but I don't know if I want to do that in Crazy Land. So, going to exit. Should take us back to the main selection screen.
There we go. And we can go to the world that I originally made. And I can show you that one, which is, uh, it was just me throwing down things. <laughs> I had no idea what I was doing. And I still don't. I have no idea. This is like the first time I played Minecraft. Yep. All right, so this is the play set. Now, I placed it on top of a house, <laughs> so it kind of, like, broke through the house. Uh... <gasps> I unlocked something. Can I unlock this? No, 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 no. Oh! Yeah! So... So you press the face on... Oh, that's cool. So it smooths it out. <laughs> this is amazing. What is this? Okay, so there's, um... That's really cool. Oh, so eat and interact. So you can get mail. Whoop. That's cool, but I don't want it. Okay. And we have a car. <laughs> <laughs> Success. <laughs> this is fantastic. This game is amazing. I wish I could zoom out a bit more, though. I really have no idea what I'm doing. Exit the vehicle. And so this is the girl that I unlocked. I unlocked her already. And... What other cool stuff is there in here? What is this? So, I, I think I'm cooking? Here's, like, my neighbor. I have not unlocked him yet, so I want to talk to him real quick. Okay, so I'm cooking. And, what? Why did I get all that money? Oh, that's cool. And we've unlocked him. Alright, well... This was uh, supposed to be a quick introduction. Uh, I think it was a little bit longer than quick. <laughs> Uh, but we're going to play more, because this is crazy. Uh, I'm going to start exploring and start using other things. I don't know. There's uh, so much to do, and I really have no idea what I'm even supposed to do. So join me next time where we play more of LEGO Worlds. See ya then.